Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to World's Best Golden Bluey. Man, I wish you guys could see my face when I say that. <laughs> I do have a camera, but I'm not going to show you. Yes. Welcome, guys. This yes. week's winner, as voted on by you guys, yes. was overwhelmingly study. Dude was running down this corridor, just poking his head around for milliseconds, but manages to find a target with every single yes. shot, either a hit marker or a kill. Going 1v5 down a corridor, pushes up through the whole thing. Incredible clip. Congrats on the win. This week, though, we got some Battlefield Hardline for you. And it's all sniper action. I know you guys love that sniper, so I'm bringing it to you. I had some amazing sniper submissions, so I put them together. And here we go. Don't forget, though, let me know in the comment section which clip is your favorite. So keep in mind which is your favorite as we go through this, because you guys are the ones who determine which is the best. Starting us out this week is the Echo by Epoxum, who starts off with that objective gameplay so beautifully. You guys know this route. Pushes straight over, and you got a swarm of people coming. No problem. Knockout action drops one, two. He's going to pick up Clat, baby. Close range point blank some, and then a long range. Look at that correction for the aim as well. He knew exactly how high to aim that. Beautiful Echo clip starting it out. Keeping along the lines of that objective gameplay, the Delta picks one, picks two, and you couldn't hear the voice at the beginning there, but he is last man alive on a 1v5. Play in the back for the support sniper here. Misses that top shot on the roof, but picks that guy with the sound listening. Here's him coming over on the right. And he just keeps getting these guys as they run to him. If these guys are on defense, they should be hanging back. Through the smoke, though, he saw him over there. Pushes over on the left-hand side halfway through his MAC-10 clip. No problem. Uses the second half of that tiny MAC-10 clip. Gets the headshot, which locks it down for the game win. Yusuf, bro, for the Charlie clip. How did you get up there? Uh, I'll show you. Look at this dude, though. He, nobody expects him to be up there. He's got the suppressor, so nobody's going to find him as well. Drops a triple on the left, triple on the right, and he just feeds on him. Close range, long range. Look at this. One, two, drops another triple, and he's just finding targets all over on such a small map with so many people. And then, of course, they finally find him because it's not on hardcore. If this was on hardcore, he would have gotten away with way more. But I had to try this out, so I went there. And I died trying to go into that same corner. So they've already patched that, but I did a bit more digging. And if you run over here, you can actually jump like right behind the street. It'll reset your 10 second countdown for being out of bounds. And you can still get up there. It's pretty much the same spot, a little bit more over to the left. You can still lie down, get up there. And you can also go over from this other direction, go to the very end, hop over the fence there. Hail Mary jump. Of course, I missed it, <laughs> scrubbing it up a little bit, but I still got it. As soon as I saw that, though, I had to figure out how it was done. And there you go. So a little bonus for those of you guys who watch this show weekly before they patch that thing, too. Coming out for the Bravo clip. Perfect headshot. And then gets a little teabag action going there. This guy's just driving in circles around him. He pulls his sniper back out, and he's not hes not about to let this drunk driver get away. Look at that. He's swerving and then perfectly gets him as he goes for that major swerve. Another little teabag celebration. This guy, for no reason, just swaps to the smaller car. And then he pulls out his pistol. You ain't killing him with the pistol. Get that sniper back out. And first shot, headshot for three driver takedowns. Look at all those cars piled up around him. Beautiful accuracy, and then he had this little bonus clip attached to the same clip, so I thought I'd show you this one too. Another beautiful, exceptional accuracy shot. Coming out for the alpha clip, though. Dar 7 then Mac Daddy's the first guy. Goes for a long range, eh, medium range, then a long ranger, and then a collateral. Turns right back around when I'm jumping out the window. Collateral again! And after beasting that hard, you do not die a normal death. The car, of course, explodes and kills him. So watch this double back-to-back -back collat, though. You couldn't even see the guy behind him. He just gets a freebie out into that five-man feed, turns right back around, and perfect shoots this guy. Watch this. Swaps over to his Mac-10. Already is already ready to shoot this next guy, but he collatted it. How perfect was that? Now, click the thumbs up if you guys enjoyed this video. Follow me on Twitter if you guys are not already. I'll probably be posting out some more bonus plays there of clips that don't make my other top shows plus i'm going to be doing a QA soon because i am getting close to 200,000 subscribers which is absolutely insane huge shout out to everybody who watches this show though shares it with a friend and a special thanks to everybody who voted in last week's episode featured on the left hand side of the screen here i don't know if it might have missed a couple people they actually are changing how youtube's comments work so my system is a bit out of whack but it should be back in order for next week thanks so much for watching though this is stonemount 64 for now.